In this video, I'm going to show you how you can build an e-commerce website step by step where you can add your products like this and anyone on the internet can check out the products and purchase them. No coding, no tech headaches. Just simple step by step instructions to get your store up and running fast. We'll also see how you can customize your website to any style you want just by using drag and drop. It's going to be very simple. I'm Brian from Website Learners and let's get started. We are going to create an e-commerce website in just five parts. The first part is to launch your website. Now this is where we get a new website live on the internet. So to launch our website, we are going to do three steps. The first step is to choose a domain name for your website. And to do that, just click the link below this video and it will take you to this page. Here you need to enter the name that you want for your website. I've already chosen a name for my website, which is iStyleNow.com. So I'm going to search for it and then click on check availability. And as you can see, the name is available. And once the name is available, we can move on to the next step, which is to get the domain hosting. Domain is the name of your website, which people have to type to visit your website. And hosting is the place where your website's files are stored. Now, there are two hosting providers that we recommend. The first one is Webspace Kit, and the second one is Hostinger. You can choose any one. In this video, I'm going to use Hostinger, and the process will be similar to Webspace Kit. So, to get a domain and hosting, let's scroll down and click here. This will take you to Hostinger. As you can see, Hostinger has different plans to choose from. You can choose your plan based on your requirements. So I'm going to select this premium plan. Now click choose plan. Next, you need to choose how long you want the hosting for. You can see that we're getting extra three months free with the 48 month plan. You can select the plan based on your requirement. So I'm going to select 48 months. And this is the total price of the hosting. Now at Website Learners, we have partnered up with Hostinger to give you an exclusive 10% discount on your purchase. To get the discount, just click here, enter the code WL10 and click apply. As you can see here, the total price has been reduced by 10%. Now click continue, sign in with your Google account and click continue. Now fill in these details for billing address. Again, click continue. Now select a payment method, enter your payment details and click submit payment. And now we have successfully got our hosting. All right, once we've got our hosting, we can move on to the next step, which is to set up your website. So to set it up, let's click on get started. Here, since we're creating a new website, choose create a new website, click next. Now here you need to choose how you want to build your website. We have two options, WordPress and Hostinger. And for this video, I'm gonna choose WordPress because it's a complete website builder with everything that we need to set up an e-commerce site quickly without coding. So let's click WordPress and click next. Here, let's set up the login details of our website. Enter a password that you'll use to access your WordPress dashboard. And please make a note of this password as it will be used later when we log into WordPress and click next. Now here we need to enter the domain name that we've chosen. As you can see, we are getting this domain name free for one year. So let's select this and click next. Now we need to register the domain name. To do that, select your country, click on next step. Here enter your contact details and click finish. Here select the location of your target audience and click install WordPress. Now WordPress will begin installing on your site and it's done. And as you can see, this is the WordPress dashboard where you can control your website. So now our website is launched and live on the internet. So to check that, let's open a new tab, enter the domain name and you can see that we have successfully launched the website. Next, we can move on to part two, which is to build your website. Now, instead of building your e-commerce website from scratch, we're going to first import a sample e-commerce site and then we are going to edit it to make our own site. So this is going to really speed up the process and it will let you build your site in a much faster way. So we're going to do this in just two simple steps. The first step is to install a new theme. To install a theme, just click the link below this video and the Astra theme will be downloaded to your computer. This theme is highly responsive and it has so many built-in features that makes it easy to build our e-commerce website. So let's upload this theme to our website. Go back to your WordPress dashboard, go to your appearance, click on themes, click here, and then click on upload theme. Just upload the file you downloaded, click install now, and click activate plugin. So now we have successfully installed and activated the Astra theme. Now we can move on to the next step, which is to import a template. To import the template, click here, 
and here you can see a variety of templates to choose from. Since we are creating an e-commerce website, let's go to the e-commerce category. Now choose the type of template you want. I'm going to select clothing store. And here you'll see the templates for the clothing store. Choose the one you want. I'm going to select this. Now here you'll see a preview of how your website will look. Here you have the options to customize the logo, font and the color of your site. If you want to change the logo, just click here and drag and drop the logo. Once you're done, you can choose the font and the color of your website. And then click continue. Now select the features you want for your website. I'm going to select this feature. This helps to send order updates and other important information to my customers through email. Once selected, click continue. Now click on this and click submit and build my website. And as you can see, our website is getting ready and it's done. And now we have successfully imported a template. Now if we go back to our website, you can see that this is how our site was before. And now if we click refresh, you can see that we have got the entire e-commerce template on our site. So now we have successfully built our website and once you've built your website, we can go to the next part, which is to set up your store. A store is the place where you can show all your products and people will purchase the products from there. To set up your store, we are going to do three simple steps. The first step is to delete these sample products. Now to delete these products, let's go back to our dashboard. Click products. Now go to all products. And here you can see all the products on your site. Click here to select all the products. Click bulk action. Now click move to trash. Then click apply. And the products will be deleted. Now if we go back to our site and click refresh, you can see that the sample products have been deleted. And now we have successfully deleted the sample products. So let's go to step two, which is to add your own products. To do that, click on add new products. And all you have to do is enter the product name, its price and some details about the product. So first let's enter the product name. Here add some details about the product. And here I'm going to enter the price. Then add a short description of the product. And done. So once you've added these details, you can now add your product image. So to add the image, just click set product image. Then drag and drop your image from the computer. And as you can see, your image has been added. You can also set up the product gallery to show different views of your product. To do that, click add product gallery images. Click here. Then drag and drop the images. Then select a category of your product. Now you can see that there are a few categories for the product. If you want to add a new category to your product, click here. Enter the name of the category and click add new category. Once you're done adding all the product details, let's click publish. And your product will be added to your site. Now if we go to our store page and click refresh. You can see that we have got our product. So now we have successfully added the product. And in the same way, you can add any number of products you want to your site. So here you can see that the pricing of the product is in dollars. So next, let's go to step three, which is to change the currency. To change the currency, go back to your dashboard. Then go to WooCommerce, click settings, scroll down. And here you'll see the option to change the currency. Just click here. Select the currency based on your country. I'm going to type INR and then select Indian rupee. Now click save changes. And if we go to our website and click refresh, you can see that our product price is now shown in rupees. And there you go. We have successfully changed the currency and we have completed setting up our store. Now let's see how people can purchase this product. So to purchase a product, just click the link on the product and click add to cart. Let's click view cart and click proceed to checkout. And here you can see that it says no payment methods are available. Now how can you pay for your products and purchase them? So let's go to the next part of this video, which is to add the payment method. Once you add a payment method, anyone can purchase your products and you can receive the payment. Now to add a payment method for your website, we are going to do three steps. The first step is to create a cash free account. Cash free is a payment gateway, which we are going to use to send and receive payments easily on your website. It supports multiple payment methods like credit cards, debit cards, UPI, net banking, and so much more. So to create an account, just click the link below this video and it'll take you to the cash free website. Now click create account. Sign in with your Google account and click continue. Now enter your mobile number and click create account. 
enter the OTP here which you received on your mobile and click confirm. And that's it. We have successfully created the cash free account. Now let's move on to the next step which is to set up your account. To do that, first select how you want to use cash free. Since we are setting this up to collect payments from our customers, let's select collect payment. Click continue. Now you need to add your business details here. So first enter your brand name. Next, select the product category. Now select your annual turnover. Select the business type and click continue. Next, select collect payment. Now you need to select on which platform you accept the payments. Since we are going to sell our products on our website, I'm going to choose website. Now you need to enter your website's URL here. So to get the URL, let's go back to our website. Copy the link. Paste it here. And click continue. Next, we need to enter our KYC information. To do that, first enter the PAN number here. Click next. Now enter the other number. Select this and click verify. Now you will receive an OTP to your Aadhaar linked mobile number. Enter the OTP here and click confirm. Next, we need to enter our business address and click next. Now enter your bank account details where you want to receive the payments. Click verify. And once it is verified, click submit details. And that's it. We have successfully set up the cash free account. Remember that once your KYC process is completed, your account will be in review and once after the review, you'll get an update shortly. Now let's move on to the next step, which is to connect cash free to your website. To connect cash free to your website, you need to install a cash free plugin. So to do that, let's go to our dashboard, click on plugins and select add plugin. Now search for cash free. Now install and activate this. Once done, go to WooCommerce, click settings, go to payments. And here you'll see the cash free options. Just click manage. To connect to cash free, you have to enter the key ID and key secret. These keys allow WooCommerce to securely connect with cash free and process the payments. So to get the key ID and key secret, go to cash free. Now go to developers, click on API keys and click generate API keys. Now we've got the keys. So let's copy the app ID first and paste it here. Then copy the secret key and paste it here. Once done, scroll down, click save changes. And now we have successfully connected the cash free account to the website and the payment method will now be added to your website. To check that, go back to our checkout page. And as you can see, previously we didn't have the payment method. So now if we click refresh, you can see that we have got the cash free payment method. So this means we have successfully added the payment method to our website. Just click pay now and it will show you the payment options. Select one, then enter the payment details, click proceed to pay. They will get this page. So this means your customer has successfully completed the payment and purchased your product. Okay, once someone has purchased a product from your website, you'll receive the payment confirmation in your email. You can see that we have two emails. The first is from our website. And here you can see the details of the product. Now let's go back, open this email and you can see that this is from Crash Free. Okay, now you know how you can receive your product payments. But what about your customer? So once a customer places an order on your site, they will receive the order confirmation email in their inbox where they can see the order details. And now you know how your customers can purchase the products from your website. So let's move on to the final part of this video which is to customize your website. So to customize your website, click on edit with Elementor and you will go to this editing section. So this is the place where you can edit the content of your website. So now let's say you want to change this text. All you have to do is just select the text you want and enter your own text. And as you can see, the text has been changed. In the same way, you can change any text you want on this page. Okay, now let's say you want to change this image. Just click here, go to style and click on choose image. Then drag and drop the image from your computer and you can see that we have successfully changed the image. In the same way, you can change any image on your website. Now to save your changes, click publish and the changes will be saved. Now if we go to our website and click refresh, you can see that the changes have been updated here. So this is how you can customize your e-commerce website. So that's it guys. Now we have the complete e-commerce website which we've made in just a few minutes. So if you're ready to start making your own e-commerce website, just click the link here and it will take you to the page that we saw in the first step 
which was choosing your domain. Also, you can get our latest videos directly on WhatsApp. You can just scan the QR or tap the link and hit follow. And that's it. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.